This is how much fun it is getting window tent off. Alright guys, so welcome back to another day with the Auto Works. As you can see behind me, the car is outside today and the bumper is up on a stand. So what we're going to do today is paint the bumper. Get everything one color. I'm not going to go in super in depth to this, but once you get the window tint off, a lot of times you got to take a razor blade, like said razor blade there. I had a different one that's actually made into a scraper, but for some reason I can't find it. Anyways, you got to get the tint off and then usually there's this glue residue and you kind of have to scrape that off too. Sometimes it'll pull off depending on how old the tin is, but most of the time you got to scrape it. So just take me a little squirt bottle, a little water bottle down there and drench everything down and uh, go to scraping. And that's how you clean old window tin off. Nice pile of old window tin. Lovely. Okay, so as I said, I had a hard time with this bumper. It had a lot of trash, a lot of stuff in it, and from now on out, we're doing things budget. So let me show you what I got. Just for anybody that's interested down the road, the color for this car is PB5 Electric Blue. But I got this mixed the cheapest way possible in a single stage, single stage, sorry, fast dry enamel. And if you look right there, you can see the label, fast dry acrylic enamel. And let's get to mixing some paint and spraying. All right, guys, and just like that, the front bumper is painted. Now, obviously, it's not a perfect color match, obviously. But this is, like I said, this is budget just, just to get by for now until I have time to actually custom paint it the right way. But it looks a lot better than if it was in primer. So that'll work. Moving on. A little tail light before and after for you. There's the new lights, and here's the crusty old ones. What a difference. And now it's got new headlights. Fog lights, tinted yellow, black corner markers, looking sharp. All right, guys, so it's another day. I actually got the seats out today. Those are the old seats. The new seats are back there. Um, let me come around here. Also, somebody has put a different shifter on this at some time and they cut the, as you can see, the end off of it and it's kind of notchy, so I'm not really big on this one. So I'm gonna take it off. What you got is you got four bolts here and then the bushings just pop off the linkages and you can change it out. All right guys, so fast forward a few days later, yes, you will notice something different. I have went ahead and put the factory wheels back on the SRT. I think it looks a lot better, more period correct than those other wheels. They were looking a little rough, but as you can see, we'll do a full walk around. We got the bumper. I know it's not perfect paint wise, but like I said, we will be repainting the car soon. And it's got the black headlights. It's got the yellow fog lights, black corners, walking around, walking around, and bam. New tail lights, looking good. No emblems, nice little side shot. So that's where we're at. All right guys, well I really appreciate you guys sticking with me for this build so far. Um, might paint it, might sell it, might get something else, who knows. But I hope you enjoyed it nonetheless. And uh, as always, like, share, comment, subscribe. I'm gonna leave you guys with some photos and I'll see you on the next one.